That's what I call a team effort. Yes. Many hands make lights work. And many cold pots make a tasty meal. Dinner is served. Happy Easter, everyone. Happy Easter, Jojo. The ladybird's back. Where's the ladybird going now, Gran Gran? Oh, ladybirds are also busy in the garden, Jojo. Are all the insects in the garden busy? Oh, yes. Ladybirds eat pests on the plants. Bees collect nectar from the flowers. And beetles stay busy eating old bark and dry leaves. And I thought we were busy in the garden, Panda. Shall we move these leaves now? Good idea, Gran Gran. Do we really have to move these leaves? The insects really like them. Hmm. I don't think they can stay here, Jojo. Unless... I think it's time for a Gran Gran plan. We could use things from the recycling pile to build a bug hotel. What do you think, Cynthia? Oh, I think that's a fantastic idea, Gran Gran. I've always wanted to build a bug hotel. What's a bug hotel? Well, a bug hotel is a safe place for insects and other garden creatures to visit and stay. We've got everything we need to get started. Old bricks. Broken flower pots. Wooden pallets. And pandas found some tiles for the roof. picture will take a long time to get to Great Grandgrand's house because it's going on a big adventure. But how will we know when it's there? Hmm, I think it's time for a Grand Grand plan. I'm going to pop this sticker on my calendar. Then every day you can move it and when it gets here, your picture should have arrived at Great Grand Grand's house. Whee! It's my picture on a whizzy machine now, Gran Gran. Maybe. I hope it doesn't get dizzy. <laughs> Is my picture on a lorry now? Yep, off you go. You've got a plane to catch. Bye! I think my picture's flying on a plane today, Gran Gran. No! Shoo! Gran Gran, I think my picture has arrived in St Lucia. And the new router's here. So we can call Great Gran Gran and see if she has it. Sunshine. There you are. Great Grand Grand. Our internet froze. So Grand Grand had to get a new router thingy. And I posted my picture to you. And what a wonderful picture it is. It arrived this morning. Do you like it? It's the best picture of St. Lucia I have ever seen. And to say thank you, I made a special picture for you, too. Oh, can I see it? Not yet. I sent it by post. By <laughs> post. Oh. Wow. Oh, hey, Jojo. Gran Gran. Jojo and I are looking for new things to discover on our way to the library. And I thought she might like a visit to your garden. Is it a garden, Jared? Why is it on the wall? 
<laughs> it's a wall garden. These plants are perfect for growing when you don't have a lot of space. This one reminds me of the octopus from your book, Jojo. It's an octopus garden. <laughs> wow! <laughs> Come on, Captain Jojo. Let's see if we can make any more discoveries. Bye! Bye, Jared. Bye! Right, which one of you little octopus plants needs a drink? Gran Gran, there's nothing new to discover in the park. We've been here lots and lots and lots of times. Come back, Monty! <laughs> Monty! You wait, wait for, for us! us. Monty. Cynthia! You found Monty! Actually, Monty found me! <laughs> oh, thanks, Cynthia. Come on, Monty. That's enough discovering for you today. Oh. See you later, everyone. Bye! Bye! <gasps> We've never been here before, Gren Gren. It's the community garden. Cynthia volunteers here. That's right. I check on the plants, pick up litter, that sort of thing. <gasps> Gran Gran! Look! Ooh. The wheels and the bus go round and round, round and round, round and round. round, and round. The wheels and the bus go round and round all day long. Oh. Why didn't the bus wait for us, Gran Gran? We didn't get to the bus stop in time. Other people will be waiting for the bus along the road. The bus can't be late for them. Oh! It's a very busy bus, Panda. Oh, missed it. Jared! Hey, Jojo! Gran Gran! Guess we'll be getting the next bus together. When will the next bus be here? Let's check the timetable. The timetable tells us the different times the buses are going to arrive. And we need the number seven, which will be here any minute now. Yay! <laughs> oh, dear. I think the bus is too full for all three of us to get on. Oh, I'm going to be late getting back to the shop. I hope there aren't any customers waiting. You get on this bus, Jared. We'll wait for the next one. What if the next bus is too full, Gran Gran? Oh, I'm sure the next bus will have space. On you get, Jared. Oh, thanks, Gran Gran. You're a legend. Oh, uh, sorry. See you later. Bye. <laughs> Don't worry, Jojo. I'm sure the next bus will be here soon. It's the next bus! Hooray! It's here! Quick, Gran Gran! Oh, that was quick. Take a look at this photo, Jojo. That's the shop. But that's not you, Jared. That is Jared's dad. This photograph was taken when I first came to live on this street. Oh, yeah. That was a long time ago. This is what the shop used to look like when my dad worked here. He liked blue, but I like... Green! Green. <laughs> mm hmm I decided I wanted a change. Much cooler. <laughs> Bye, Jared! Let's... <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh! The park looks the same, Gran Gran. Are you sure? <gasps> it's a different tree. It's the same tree, Jojo, but when your mummy was little, it was only small. Now it has grown really tall. Hmm. Has anything else changed, Gran Gran? Whee! 
When your mummy was little, these swings weren't here at all. What about the roundabout? No, the roundabout wasn't here either. And the slide is brand new. Whee! I like that change. <laughs> But this old bench has been here for as long as I can remember. Nino, 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 Nino. Who's our first patient, Dr Jojo? This is patient Panda. Hmm. We need to give you a little stitch. Can you take Panda to the kitchen, please, Dr Jojo? Dr. Gran Gran. That's okay. Now, I think Panda will need some rest. Then you can both go back to exploring. I'll make you all comfy on the sofa. Are you ready for some lunch now, Jojo? Not yet, Gran Gran. Nino, Nino. <laughs> These toys need to visit Gran Gran's hospital as well. <laughs> Hugo! Oh, hello, Hugo. Ah, yes, I think you need an X-ray. An X-ray? It's a special photo that helps to see bones. Ah. If we pop this stick next to your plant, we can measure how much it has grown and... If we draw a new line every week, we can see how much your plant is growing. I will keep looking after it, just like Cynthia said. Awesome, Jojo. It looks just like a trumpet. And you must have been taking really good care of it, too. <laughs> the flowers in your kitchen are all droopy, Gran Gran. <laughs> it's called wilting, Jojo. That's what happens to flowers over time. It means it's time to pop them in the compost bin. Eventually, these old flowers will turn into compost and we use compost in the garden to help new flowers grow. Ah! I hope our roses don't wilt, Gran Gran. I want to keep them forever. Oh, flowers don't last forever, Jojo. Even roses. Hmm. 
But if we keep them watered and take good care of them, they'll stay like this for a week or so, giving us plenty of time to admire them. Gran, Gran, you forgot one. Ah, that's because there is one way to stop flowers from wilting. Jojo, I think it's time for a Gran Gran plan. <laughs> I'm going to show you how to press a flower. Press a flower? <laughs> it means pressing it flat with something heavy and leaving it to dry out. First, we're going to need some books. Oh, what about my Captain Chloe book, Gran Gran? It's very good. Hmm, we can use that to hold the flower and then we need some thick, heavy books to press down on it. <laughs> what about this book? Oh, that looks heavy enough to me. Can you see any more? Hmm, yes. No, no, and yes! <laughs> this is a special kite that Great Grand Grand made for me for the St Lucia Kite Flying Festival. Oh, Kite Flying Festival! Oh, let's call Great Grand Grand. She can tell you all about it. Jojo, my little sunshine, how lovely to see you! Hello, Great Gran Gran. Hello, Mama. Great Gran Gran, it's very windy today, and my picture of Super Panda almost blew away. But then we got it back, and then Gran Gran found this. Our old kite. I haven't seen that for years, Gran Gran. I've been keeping it safe, Mama. You know, Jojo. Gran Gran used to fly this kite at the St Lucia Kite Flying Festival. I got a photo somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> ah, I found it. See, Jojo, this is me and Gran Gran at the festival. Oh, wow. Do we have a kite flying festival, Gran Gran? I don't think so. But we don't need a festival to fly this kite. We just need the right weather. <laughs> Don't forget to send me a picture. This looks like a good spot. <laughs> OK, Jojo, hold the handle and don't let go. I think it's going to go as high as the clouds, Panda. Are you ready, Jojo? Ready! <laughs> Gran Gran, who makes the weather forecast? Is it magic? <laughs> no. Scientists called meteorologists predict what the weather will be like. Meteor... Hmm... Meteorologists. Meteorologists. Mmm. David! Hey, Jojo! Gran Gran! Yay! <laughs> Where are you two off to? We're going to the park. And I'm going down the big slide. But the weather forecast says it's going to rain later, so we need to get a wiggle on. But <laughs> That's why I'm selling umbrellas today. <laughs> hey! <laughs> wow! Would you like one? Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> oh, thanks, Jared. But I've got a plan. Of course you have, Gran Gran. It's getting cloudy, Jojo. If we want to get to the park before it rains, we need to get a... Wiggle on! <laughs> <laughs> Bye, Jared! Bye, Jared! Bye. Oh, 
Jojo. Hello, Grand Gran. Where are you two off to today? We're going to the playground. To slide down the big slide. Oh, the big slide. Oh, but we have to get a wiggle on. <laughs> you know, Jojo, art isn't just for looking at. Really? Really. I think you're going to enjoy the final stop on the tour. Yes. This is the craft station. Everything you need to make your own pieces of art. Oh, how exciting! <laughs> I hope this all fits in my bag, Jojo. Is that a panda painting I see? Mm-hmm. Do you like it, Marie? Oh, it's a mini masterpiece. I think you've made enough art to fill the whole gallery. <gasps> that gives me an idea for a grand grand plan. What do you want to show so us, Jojo? Excited. Daddy, Mummy, Pandas and Dinosaurs, welcome to the grand opening of Jojo and Grand Grand's Garden Gallery. Oh! The tour is starting. Follow me. This is called Queen Panda. Oh, wow. Queen Panda. Oh, yes. Very regal. This is called Panda and the Trumpet Flowers. Ooh! Wow! And what's this painting of, Jojo? This is an abstract painting, Daddy. It's not meant to look like anything. Well, when I look at this painting, I see my favourite artist, Jojo. And I see a very proud mummy, Daddy, and Gran Gran. <laughs> I know the first thing that needs to go in our spring clear-out box. <gasps> this old thing. Your jumper? But I love your grand-grand jumper. It's so snuggly. <gasps> and sometimes there's a sweet in the pocket. Oh, a button. In the spring clear-out box it goes. Hmm. And I've got more old stuff upstairs. I'll just pop and get it. <laughs> Hmm. I love this old jumper panda. What's that panda? You don't think it should go in the spring clear old box? Hmm. <laughs> <gasps> An old straw hat. Vup! And one odd sock. Let's see what else we can find. Hmm. Oh. <laughs> um. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Huh? What's this? I thought I'd put this in the spring clear out box. <laughs> Let's look for more old things in the sitting room, Jojo. Coming! Let's find somewhere new to hide it. Hmm. What are these, Gran Gran? They're called CDs. They play music. <laughs> wow! Hmm. I can't hear any music. <laughs> it's because I don't have a CD player anymore. I love butterflies. Butterfly. Butterfly. <gasps> oh, you're not a butterfly. Oh. Do you know what this is, Jojo? Hmm. It's not in my nature tick book. This is a caterpillar. <laughs> Hello, little caterpillar. Finding this caterpillar means, in a way, we've almost found a butterfly. Almost found a butterfly? What do you mean, Gran Gran? This little caterpillar is nothing like a butterfly. 
It's little and furry. And it doesn't have wings. That's true. But one day, this furry little caterpillar will change into a butterfly with beautiful, colourful wings. Really? This little caterpillar will change into a butterfly? Mmm. It's amazing. A caterpillar hatches from a tiny egg. <laughs> then the caterpillar eats, eats and eats until it's ready to change. Into a butterfly? Not yet. It needs a bit more time. Once the caterpillar has eaten enough, it hangs upside down and changes into a chrysalis. Ooh, it looks like a leaf grand grand. <laughs> it does, doesn't it? The caterpillar stays that way for a long time as it changes into a butterfly. With beautiful, colourful wings. Wow, that's amazing. Wow, look, Gren Gren. Stop! I'm the Pirate Queen. Who wants to come into my castle? It is I, Gren Gren. My Pirate Knight says you can enter. <laughs> Welcome to the castle. I'm Bonnie. Would you like me to show you around? Oh, we'd love that, wouldn't we, Jojo? Yes, please, Bonnie. Follow me across the drawbridge. Ah. Why is the castle falling down, Gren Gren? Well, the castle is so old that people don't live here anymore. And some bits of it are in ruins. This moat used to look very different. It was full of water. Wow! What do you think this room used to be? Um, I don't know. What if I told you that you have one of these rooms in your house? I can't see anything that looks like my house. Or yours, Gren Gren! <laughs> this used to be... The castle kitchen! It doesn't look like a kitchen. Well, what did you do when we played Pirate Queen and you couldn't spot the ship? Hmm. We used our imagination. Imagine how many dinners you could make in this pot. It's very big. Panda! I need 100 tomatoes and lots and lots of peas. Is it yummy enough for a pirate queen? Mm -mm. Yes, it is. <laughs> that was close, Sailor Gren Gren. Yes, we just escaped that dinosaur. But we haven't found the treasure. Where shall we look next? Mm. Through that secret door. Ooh, into the secret cove. Yes! A secret treasure cove! You first, Pirate Panda. All clear. Whoa! It looks just like your kitchen, Gran Gran. <laughs> Let's explore. Can you see any treasure, Captain Jojo? Not yet, Sailor Gran Gran. Can you see any? No. But... <gasps> I think I just stood on a pressure pad. A pressure pad? Afraid so. It activates the pirate traps. <gasps> oh no, the pirate traps. This giant boulder is coming right towards us. What should we do, Captain Jojo? Quick, under the table. <gasps> oh, that was a close one, Captain Jojo. Yes. The boulder just missed us. This is a great story, Jojo. What happens next? Hmm. We still need to find the treasure. Oh, yes. <gasps> oh, what have you found, Captain Jojo? The treasure! My favourite Captain Clark! 
Chloe book. Wonderful. A perfect end for a perfect story. Shall we read Captain Chloe now? Hmm. I'm really glad we found my favourite storybook. What are you drawing, Jojo? It's a menu for my own cafe. Oh, is that me? Yes, you're the chef. It's called Jojo and Grand Grand's Cafe. And it's very special because it sells solution food. There's macaroni pie, Panda's favourite, Callaloo soup, fried plantain and bakes. <gasps> Jojo! I think it's time for a grand grand plan. We can use your menu to open our own cafe at home. Woohoo! We're ready to open. Welcome to Jojo and Grand Grand's Cafe. Can I take your order, please? Jojo, I think we've forgotten something. The menu! Here you are, Panda. There you go, Hugo. What can I get for you? Mm-hmm. Yes. Of course. And for you, Hugo? Mm-hmm. Good choice. I'll tell the chef. <laughs> chef Grand Grand! The sun was shining. And Jojo and Grand Grand, that's me, were visiting Jared's shop. Jared! Hey, Jojo. Grand Grand. Is there anything I can help you with today? We're just looking for a few bits and pieces. If you need help finding something, just ask. Thank you, Jared. What's first on our list, Jojo? Mm, strawberries. Strawberries are on this shelf. Oh, and before I forget, there's a special offer on today. Buy one, get one free. What does that mean? Well, if you buy this punnet of strawberries, I'll give you another punnet for free. Only the best for my community. <laughs> Thanks, Jared. What's next on our list, Jojo? Cereal. Hmm. Right this way, Jojo. <laughs> Thank you. Look, Grand Grand. <laughs> Cynthia! Hello, Jojo. Oh, hi, Cynthia. What are you buying today? Oh, I only popped in for bird seed, but Jared's shop really does have everything you need. Hmm, that's nearly everything. I just need to go to the till. Jared, how do you know where everything is? In my shop, there is a place for everything, and everything has its place. The strawberries are on that shelf, the cereal is over there, and the bird seed is just here. I'd love to have a shop, Grand Grand. Oh, we can play shopkeepers when we get home. Yes, please. Oh, can I be your first customer, Jojo? Not if I get there first, Cynthia. <laughs> 30 minutes starts... Now. Grand Grand, is 30 minutes nearly gone? <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. I'm afraid not. There's still a long time to go. We have to wait so long. And the banana bread smells so nice. And I would really, really like to taste it. It might feel like a long time to wait, Jojo. But we can make the time fly if we keep busy. And luckily, we've got two more jobs to do. 
first, we need to make a tasty topping for the banana bread. Lemon icing. It's my own secret recipe. Careful, Jojo. Lemons on their own are a bit... Ooh, sour. <laughs> longer till our banana bread is ready, Gran Gran. Uh, we still have 15 minutes to go. But that's ages. We need to make the time fly, don't we, Panda? Whee! <laughs> I have one more job for us to do to make the time fly. Washing up. That was fun. Mmm. Oh. <laughs> See, 30 minutes has flown by. Wow. Look, Panda. Grand Grain, how are ya? <laughs> Good, thanks. And you? Oh, you know me, Grand Grain, keeping busy selling fish. <laughs> and this here must be Jojo. Hello, Navid. Oh, it's a bit cold here. That'll be the ice. It keeps the fish fresh. Ooh. This is my most popular fish, Jojo. That's why I like to get here early, before it's sold out. Is it the usual, Grand Grand? Four fresh fish, please. Cleaned and scaled. Oh, and before I forget, I've got something for you, too. Oh, banana bread? Isn't your Grand Grand the best, Jojo? Ha! <laughs> <Huh. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Monty. Sorry, Jojo. Hi, right, Grand Grand. Down, Monty. We're looking for the pet stall. Monty needs a new ball. He lost the old one in the park. We can help you find the pet stall. Oh, thanks, Jojo. If that's OK, Gran Gran. Naveed, we'll be back in a minute. <gasps> Gran Gran, look. Someone's painted these trees white. <laughs> it looks like paint, but it's just the bark. These are silver birch trees. Wow. Silver. This bit can go on our journey stick, Panda. It's blue. Oh, it's covered in bluebells, Jojo. Can I have one for my journey stick? Well, we can't pick any. But these have fallen, so we can stick these ones on. Jojo. A den. Hiya. <gasps> <laughs> Guess what? We found an owl. Really? Well, we didn't exactly find an owl, but we did find a feather which might be from an owl. We're looking for something else to stick on our journey stick. We could use this. <laughs> that might be a little bit big. <laughs> How about these? Thank you, Gran Gran. Thank 
it, Scranga. Right, Isa. Let's see what else we can spot before lunch. See you later. Bye, Jojo. Bye. Bye. Melanie hatched from an egg. Uh-huh. At first, she was a little baby chick. That's her new meta, Jojo. Yeah. Then Melanie started to grow bigger and bigger and grow more and more feathers. Whoa. Until she became the fully grown chicken she is today. But Cran Cran, I haven't grown that much. Well, some animals grow more quickly than people. You can give Melanie a little stroke if you like. Hello, Melanie. You're a grown-up chicken now. <gasps> She's still really soft, Gran Gran. Would you like a new photo with Melanie? Yes, please! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> this building's called the Hatchery. It's very special. To enter, we all have to be very, very quiet. Okay? Okay. 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 Follow me. This is an incubator. We keep some of the eggs safe and warm in here until they're ready to hatch. <gasps> Look, Jojo. Oh, wow. She's so tiny and fluffy. <laughs> Would you like to name her? <gasps> yes, please. I like to call her... Um, Ma Marjorie. Marjorie, oh, that's a great name. It's the community jam panda. Hi, everyone. Hi, Hi JJ. JJ. Hi, Hi Gran Gran. Gran. Oh, hello there. Wow, look at all those instruments, Gran Gran. That's my dad playing that saxophone. A keyboard. Naveed's playing the drums. I made you this so you can join in. It's a shaky, shake, shaker. Thank you, Gran Gran. I love it. Now that everyone has arrived, it looks like we're in for a treat. Here's your host, Jerry! Thank you all for coming. It's a lovely day and it's time to jam! One, two, three, four. Be Charlene's turn soon. A party whose name is Spring. <laughs> <laughs> Jared, I'm afraid Charlene's late. I'm not sure she's going to make it. What should we do? Ah. Oh. Um. Uh, hi everyone. We've just heard that Charlene's been held up in traffic. Oh. So unfortunately, we'll have to cancel her Spring song. Oh, I wanted to hear Charlene's song. Hi. Hello everyone. Hey Jojo. Hey Gran Gran. Is that the banner we're holding at the marathon, Charlene? Oh, yes! Team Jared all the way! <laughs> You're on Team Jared too? We all are. I'm making sure everyone has enough water. Running a marathon is thirsty work. Oh, we need to make sure we arrive early to get a good spot. Ooh. Oh, looking good. All we need now are some snacks. Oh, we can bring snacks, can't we, Jojo? Why do we need a snack at the marathon? Well, to keep us all going. It's such a long race, Team Jared will need a lot of energy. I don't think we can be on Team Jared, Panda. The race is too long. Do you want to help me stir? Mm. 
What's the matter, Jojo? Oh, it's a marathon. We can't be on Team Jerry tomorrow. Why not? I've never run in a really long race before. I won't be able to keep up. Oh, Jojo. We're not running in the marathon with Jared. We're not? No. Team Jared's going to support him. We'll be standing outside the library cheering him on. That's almost as important as the racing. It is? Absolutely. The marathon is such a long race. By the time the runners get to us, they'll need a boost. Do you think you can do some good cheering? Yes! Me and Panda are very good at cheering. 